We got this SUV air mattress. Let's take this thing out of the box and check it out. All right, so this is it out of the box. It does come with an inflator that uses a 12 volt accessory port to run it. The inflator comes with a manual and an adapter. This is a basic overview, specs, precautions, all that about the air mattress. And then of course the air mattress. Now I'm not gonna pull this all out right here. We're gonna go put this in the SUV. But what I do wanna note here is it does come with the two stage valves on it. I really like that. So that way it's easy to air up and you're not struggling trying to get it aired up all the way. So let's do it. Let's get this thing spread out and put it in the SUV. All right, so I've got the mattress all spread out in the back of our SUV. And it actually came with some other items that it does say on the little instruction manual, but I didn't point out when I was pulling it out of the box because it needed to be unfolded. All of this right here, other than this, was packed inside of the mattress. So when you unfold the mattress, you're going to find it. And there are actually some pretty neat, useful things. This is a brace or a support that when you air that up, let's say you are wanting to just air up half of this because it is two sections and you only want to lay it across the seats of the middle row of your SUV, you can air this up, stick it down into the floorboard area, and it supports the bed. So that way you can fill in the gaps of where you may fall if the mattress was just laid on the seats. So that is really cool. And I'll try to demonstrate that a little bit after I show the back part here. Then it came with a carrying bag where you can fold it all back up, put it back in the carrying bag, and two air up pillows. So you have some air pillows there that you can use with this mattress. Now let's go ahead and get this thing all aired up so you can see it. All right, and here it is all aired up. I've got the support brace way back there in the back. I didn't really need it in this configuration, but I still aired it up and put it back there. And then I have the two pillows aired up. And as you can see here, I've got the larger side and the smaller side aired up. You could make the decision if you wanted to only have one person sleeping on this, you could make the decision on which side is most comfortable for you and you just air up one side, then you could roll up the other, whatever you wanted to do. Plus that also works if you have your seats up and you're putting it sideways across your vehicle, you'd have to choose which size fits best, put the support brace down and you're good to go. Now it does come with this air pump that has the 12 volt accessory plug and that would be used on a plug like this in your vehicle. So let me deflate one of these sides so I can show you what a one person configuration would look like. And if you see here, this is how you would use it in a single person or maybe even two people could fit in here, but this is the configuration that you would use to fit it over your seats in the middle row. At least ours is three rows. As you can see here, the deflated side is just folded under and the support beam is down here, keeping you from falling down on the floor. So very cool. I like the whole configuration. It's very neat, multi-use. It could be used in your SUV. It could be used on the beach, your front yard, hanging out at the park. It could be used in your house when guests come over. It's a very versatile air mattress and I like it a lot. So definitely gets a thumbs up from me. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you very much for watching. Y'all take care.